everybody. If you're new here, we went to all 20 Detroit Lions games. Today, we're going to be taking you through the first 10. Make sure if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. And part two is coming out next week, so stay tuned. Let's get right into it. Hi, I'm Eric. I'm Katie. And this year, we're going to all 20 Detroit Lions games. No one's excited about preseason, so let's do a quick recap. Spoiler alert, Ford Field has the best hot pretzels. Absolutely hate to see the first game of the year end with a loss, but either way, we're looking forward to our first road trip on to Indianapolis we go. You guys want to meet some of your favorite players and get zapped with your buddies? Highly recommend traveling to an open joint practice. We get Melka Rodriguez to sign Look his jersey. This was the goal. This was the goal for the entire season. Is Although it was only preseason, it was so awesome to see the Lions come home with a win. Man, vibes were absolutely off the charts in Indy. We're excited to see what Pittsburgh can bring to the table, boys. End of the first quarter, Lions don't look good at all at all. The hottest game I've ever felt. Usually I'm crying. Like, I look up at the scoreboard, it's already halftime. It's only the end of the first quarter. I'm you, this is death out here, you guys. Go. It's like almost unbearable to watch, and it's a preseason game. You love being here and shit. This is the hardest game I've ever had to watch. The energy's low. The morale here is low, guys. <laughs> Malcolm was awesome enough to give us his sleeve. And I got it signed. Got it signed. Took that L on the chin. Thank God preseason's over. We're ready to take on Philly week one, baby. Dude, this is the craziest shit I've ever seen. I've been to literally every home game for like the last 20 years. I have never seen this in my life. Got a little carried away at the tailgate, but we finally made it in the building. Oh, we almost pulled off that major comeback. Not how you want to start the season, but we love our chances against Washington. All of you, subscribe. You don't subscribe to this channel right here. I don't trust one fucking bit. We're going on the road all year. Let us know what you want to see. We want to hang out with all of you guys. You guys better come to the corner of Madison and Brush. I want to see all of your beautiful faces there. And that includes the visiting fans. If you guys are playing Detroit this season, get to the corner of Madison and Brush. We want to hang with you and get litty, baby. Week two. Lock the dog. Lock the dog. Lock the dog. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Get a, get a hell yeah. Hell yeah. Get a, get a two dollar. No. Absolutely tragic day to be a Commanders fan, folks. Back win against the Commanders. You better watch your back, Minnesota. You do not want these problems, boy. This is the lucky shirt. This is the lucky shirt. Most awkward moment of all time, being the only Detroit Lions fans in an all-Minnesota Vikings tailgate lot. 
We were lucky enough to find an amazing group and we had a ton of fun. Looking forward to seeing these beauties again this season, baby. You're saying this guy from South Dakota has been coming for 16 years to every I game. I missed a game, preseason doesn't count. Here, How you're far. <laughs> we're not that good. Okay, like 45-27. You said 45-27, but Lions, of course, right? No, no, no. <laughs> no. 24-20 Vikings. Viking staff by far the nicest. These two absolute gems hooked us up with club access. I'm absolutely sick just watching this footage. No idea how we absolutely choked that loss. Either way, on to the Seahawks and on to the most lit tailgate we've ever been to. Start to hurt. Start to hurt. Too easy. Start to hurt. Lions game day, baby. Let's they go. Hate when you elevate. The second of losses, I'm handing them out. Yeah, I had to go delegate. It feel like I'm floating. I'm lost in the moment. I swear I could levitate. They never believed that I would really fly. I had to go demonstrate. I had to set them straight. Feeling myself, ain't no chance of coming down, no. Got a soul view to myself, yeah. Why would I give it up? Why do they want to come take my Tony told me since it was six and a half, bet your life on Seahawks plus six and a half. I've been saying money line all week. Tony doesn't necessarily think the same. Would have been a great bet, but god damn it, if we would have bet. If we had a bet like we said, we'd be a rich we'd be millionaires. man. We would be millionaires. Every game you can bet against the Lions, you win. You pretty much win. I mean, they already went for it. Wide open. Yeah. Yeah. And then, of course, he looks like Gino what? Brady. Tom Brady mixed with Mike Vick. Somehow, he's going to. don't run like that. Another career day for another uh, player playing against the Lions. Just earned his next contract yeah. off today. Fuck this. This is so All annoying. All the sports networks will be talking about him after the game. Gino, yeah, is he a legit league. quarterback? I, I absolutely hate the Lions more than anything in this world. A six and a half is sacred territory. I told you money line, even crazier. The Lions are not the team that pops you in the mouth. We're the team that gets popped. We're gonna go to New England, a game that we shouldn't win, and we're just gonna go fucking molest yeah. the Patriots. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. Made it inside the stadium. This is the sick. vibes are a mac. Yeah, honestly, this is oh, nice. insane. This is, I'm so excited to get down to the field. I Oh my gosh, you guys, ran into someone who watches the channel. What's your name? Jeremy. Jeremy. Jeremy absolute legend out here, watches the channel, came up to us. Guy's a beauty. Game was off to an absolutely brutal start. Did not help when Savion Smith got carted off in an ambulance. You could feel the energy leave the Lions sideline immediately. Prayers up for Savion Smith. That was scary as shit. 29 nothing loss. I don't care how many times I say it on this channel, the New England Patriots game was the worst game of all time. Excuse my friend, Mr. Porta Potty, but this stadium was the craziest one by far. Wow, this is the entrance? It makes Ford Field look like a dump. Yeah. And More I like love Ford Field. Don't get me wrong, I love it. You guys. Made it here to 
to AT&T Stadium. This place is so insane. It's brand new. There's tile floors. It's glass. It's bright. You Best know. stadium we've ever seen. I'm always not optimistic with the Lions. I think we pull out a W. The stadium's got electric vibes. I'm so excited for today. My favorite stadium, my favorite experience. We got sweet access and we were able to get on the field after the game. Absolutely magical. I can't do the spin. I can't do the spin, you guys. Oh, absolutely devastating loss in Dallas. We got to get ready to wake up and take care of business back home in Detroit against the Miami Dolphins. One and five, seven and five. We don't give a damn. We're on the way up. Here we go again. <laughs> Mm. Like, Katie, That's got some bite. <laughs> it's loud in here. Yeah! And that wraps up the first 10 games of the season. You guys got to make sure, please smash that subscribe button. Part 2 is coming out next week. Leave a sassy comment. Which stadium was your favorite? Take it easy. It's too easy, baby.